To connect your AntMiner to the internet, you will need to connect it to a router or modem with an ethernet cable. Once it is connected, you will need to configure your network settings. The exact settings will vary depending on your router, but you will likely need to assign it a static IP address. Once your network settings are configured, you should be able to access the miner's web interface by entering its IP address into a web browser. From the web interface, you will be able to monitor the miner's performance and make any necessary changes to its configuration. If you want to get the most out of your Ant Miner, there are a few things you can do to ensure it runs at peak performance. First, make sure the firmware is up to date. Newer versions of the firmware can improve hash rate and efficiency, so it's always a good idea to be running the latest release. Second, overclock the miners if possible. This will increase hash rate and may also improve efficiency. However, it's important to be careful when overclocking, as pushing the hardware too hard can lead to instability and ultimately reduce profitability. Finally, keep an eye on the temperature and make sure the miners operate within safe limits. Overheating can damage the chips and reduce lifespan, so it's important to keep things cool. Ant Miner Aftermarket Firmware allows for auto-tuning of mining hardware to achieve the best possible hash rate. However, many users are unaware of this feature and leave their miners running at suboptimal settings. By auto-tuning your Bitmain Ant Miner, you can ensure that it is always operating at peak performance. The process is simple. Navigate to the Mining Profile page in your management interface and select the desired hash rate. The Ant Miner will then automatically adjust its settings to achieve that hash rate. Overall, the Ant Miner is a great bit of hardware that can provide you with some serious hashing power. By following our tips for setting it up and overclocking it, you can get the most out of your device and generate some profits. Make sure to monitor your ant miner's temperature and fan speed so that you don't run into any problems, and good luck mining.